What's up guys? Josh here from Mile High Vapen. Today I got a battery charger for you. This one's the VP1 by Xstar. Notice there's not a lot of vape reviewers out there um, reviewing what charger they use. Sometimes we get a flash of what batteries they're using. They always say make sure you're using uh, good batteries, but they don't really ever say what batteries. Yeah, VTC5s, which are impossible to find. And every website, vape shop you go on, they seem to only sell night cores or e-fests. I've used the, the night core for about a month, and I returned the thing. It was horrible. Did some more research, ended up going with this guy. It's a great charger. Um, two bays. Not a lot I can tell you up here. So let's uh, dive down and see what we get in the box. I picked this guy up off of Amazon for $29.95. VP1 X Star multifunctional lithium ion battery charger. Um, charges in 0.25 amps, 0.5 and 1 amp. Two independent channels. Uh, it will activate over discharge batteries, so if you drain your batteries too low it will try to bring them back from life back to life uh, it's an intelligent charger reverse polarity protection uh, it's got a real-time display and low heat all the batteries it applies to I will leave that in the description Nextstarlight.com. Then they also make flashlights. Oh, there's a better image of all the batteries this applies to. 10 440s, 14 500s, 14 650, 16 340s, 17 500, 17 670, 18 350, 18 500, 18 650, and 18 700s. Um, I don't own any 26650s, but I have heard that this will hold a single 26650. Not sure if that's recommended. Though. Um, then we got some more features on the back here. Uh, pretty much going over the same things on the front. Let's see what we get in this box. On Amazon, there are two different versions. $29.95 gets you the full package, which includes your charger, your wall, and your cardboard plug. So get a warranty card, one year warranty. I got my authenticity sticker here, which is supposed to be on the front, but I, I peeled it off. It's, I like it, it looks a little cleaner. One year warranty, hold on to that. And then you get your instruction booklet. Um, it's a pretty basic charger. So the most important thing in here is Or it tells you what current to charge your batteries on. I don't know if that's going to show up here. Yeah. Your smaller batteries you're going to want to charge on the lower amperage um, and then medium size and your larger batteries. I've been charging my 18650s on uh, the 0.5 setting just uh, for battery life, make my batteries last longer, supposedly. I don't know. Uh, but you could charge them at 1 amp, 
uh, be just fine and they'll charge a lot faster been charging mine in about six and a half hours at the 0.5 amps and I do that at night so it's not really a, a big deal I have two sets of batteries for my my box mine so they're drained I just swap them out for a new pair so never have a mod without battery plug her in she fires up starts off at um, your 0.25 amps um, the screens pretty simple there's one button on here it changes your amperage whatever that says will be charging it'll be putting that amperage to both channels here um, you can charge two different size batteries at the same time but make sure that they can handle the same amperage. You don't want to put a little one on there with an 18650 if it can't handle the one amp charge. But your your vapor, you're probably just going to be using your 18650s or the other 1800 series. Okay, and that is pretty light, little and sleek. It's got some little grip on the bottom. on the back. Uh, I've been using this guy for about two months now. The springs, they've broken in a little, but they're still pretty crunchy. But batteries don't move around there. They're solid. Hasn't damaged my batteries at all. Um, Alright, we got the dead battery here. Not fully dead, but close to being dead. 18650 E-Fist, 35 amp. Let's see, tells you what volts the battery's at, and it starts charging. It drops all the way down because this battery is a fully dead battery. And it will keep going up until 4.2 volts, and it will not overcharge your battery. It will cut off at that point. Now let's get another one on here, see what that looks like. Uh, Got a Samsung 25R here. This one should be close to fully charged. Um, 4.11 volts. There you go. See, four bars. And bump it up. Yeah, I think it's a great charger. I like that you can see the display on here and you can see how how far along your battery is charged. Um, it's, it's solid. It doesn't overheat like I had the like the Digicharger before and returned that one. Um, not the Digicharger, the IntelliCharger with just the, the lights on there. And it would be going for all day long. I was worried I had messed up batteries or something. I'd pull my batteries off, put them in my mod, and it would say that they were fully charged. But the damn IntelliCharger would be charging them for two straight days. I don't know if it was actually charging it or the lights were just messed up on it, but I wasn't happy with it. And it did get a little warmer because the battery pack is built into the charger, unlike this guy. Um, it's on the wall warp, so it does stay cooler. You get the car charger with it, which is nice. Um, it's pretty small, doesn't take up very much room on my desk. Yeah, if you're looking for one of these, I think it's pretty sweet. I right, guess let's go back up top. Okay, guys, so that's the VP1 by XStar. If you're in the market for a new charger, you want to upgrade yours, you're a new vapor or somebody trying to upgrade from like an EVOD to let's say a box mod or a mechanical and you're going to need 18650s, I would definitely recommend checking out XSTAR. Um, this is I believe the cheaper one on their line. They sell the, the 4 bay chargers and I believe they have some, some newer versions out. Uh, but as far as a competitor with the EFESTs and IntelliChargers, I'd say this VP1 is on top, and there's not a lot of 
a lot of people talking about them. You don't see this in vape shops. I highly recommend checking it out. Go look at um, some other reviews on it. It's a great charger. I'm very happy with it. You guys will be too. Thanks for watching my live vaping. As always, links are in the description. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up, guys. If you want to see more of my videos, subscribe. You got a comment, want to talk to me, leave a comment down below. Other than that, peace. Keep on vaping, guys.